The South African national women's football team were met with a warm welcome in Tembisa with hundreds of fans queuing to get a glimpse of their footballing heroes and to get an autograph from players like captain Janine van Veek who will turn out for 127th appearance when Banyana faced Botswana in the second leg of the African Women's Championship qualifier on Tuesday night. These are the people that uh, we play for. It's our country. These are our kind of supporters that we, we go out and, and do our best that we can do, get good results for. Um, they always come out in numbers, so it's good to interact, to interact with them and, you know, just have a, a day like this where they can meet and greet their, their, their idols. Banyana Banyana go into the encounter quietly confident being 2-0 up on aggregate against their southern African neighbours. But for forward Rafiwe Jane, it is important to repay the fans with a solid performance against the woman from Botswana. It's going to be difficult for us also because you know that they're going to come hard at us. It wasn't an easy win. We saw it and it took a, a whole lot of effort for us to win that game. We're going to prepare it very hard and also mentally because we know that one slight mistake we can be out of the tournament for qualifying. Coach Vera Pau, who heads off to Brazil on Wednesday for the Olympic Games football draw, feels it's imperative not to relax against a potentially dangerous team, especially when qualification is at stake. It sounds more comfortable than it is, let's say it like that. But if we are at our best, then it could equally go the other way, that we will, have, will be able to, uh, to win comfortably. But we know that we have to be at the best of our game, because otherwise if they score early in the game, you get a completely different game. This signing session will come as a welcome distraction to the Banyana Banyana players who have been grafting hard, preparing for the two legs against Botswana. They go into the second leg 2-0 up and they can't afford to be complacent against a hungry Zebras team, especially if they want to book their place in Cameroon at the African Women's Championship. CS Duplessis, CCTV, Tembisa.